On behalf of the Michigan House of Representatives, I want to welcome all of you here today in recognition of our first responders and our military members. I also want to thank you for coming here today to honor these brave heroes. We remember them on September 11th because on that day, our nation watched the worst this world has to offer. However, we also witnessed our best. In the shadow of incredible tragedy and in the confusion and fear that immediately followed the attacks, we watched hundreds of police officers and firefighters put their own lives on the line to keep us safe. More than 400 of them gave their lives on that day. And in the months and the years that followed, thousands of American servicemen and servicewomen put themselves in harm's way to protect our nation overseas, and most importantly, here at home. And many of them paid the ultimate sacrifice to do so. These brave souls protect our lives, they protect our freedom, and every day they place us, our families, and our loved ones above themselves. We come together on this day each year to honor these men and women for their sacrifice and for their service here at home. Today, we remember the 10 first responders and the four members of the military from Michigan who gave their lives in the line of duty over the past year. And we honor the men and women who continue to stand guard and watch over our great state, both here at home and abroad. Let us always remember the sacrifices they have made to protect us and our families. Members, could we now please show appreciation to all of our guests here today?